Hi, today I am going to make clematis, a really beautiful climber which comes in really lovely shades of colors. Materials required are crepe papers in pink, yellow, red and green, a pink colored pencil, darker tone than the paper, red acrylic colors, thin wire, a thick wire and green floral tape. The stencils and measurements are given at the end of video. First cut about 20 cm long wire, thin wire. Then take the green tape and wind it round this wire. Stretch it and wind this whole wire with it. Now take the red strip and cut out, make fine cuts on it all along the whole length and leave a margin about half a centimeter here. So cut very very fine strips the whole length like this. Now just curl them gently. So that they don't tear off. Like this. Turn them over. Now this particular paper was actually pink on one side and red on one side. So, uh, but I want the red there. So anyway, so you apply glue on the base and wind this on top of the thin wire that we've wrapped it tape. So just wind the whole thing on it, keeping the same height. So now take this and just hold the top of, of the stamen all together and then sort of just you know press it down. So it forms this bulged out shape. Now take the yellow strip and take some red acrylic color and apply it on one side just covering about half a centimeter. You don't have to be very neat about it. Just sort of dab it. Like this. And now you let it dry first. After it has dried, again, this as we did on the red strip, cut fine strip on this also. In the same manner, leaving half a centimeter margin here. Like this. Now curl these. So we want them curling up like this. I am just going to flip it over and curl the stamen gently. Like this. And from this side, just sort of hold a pencil next to the paper and curl it over. 
so that the base also curls just hold it and press it on the pencil this is kind of curvy one now apply glue on the base and wind it on top of the red stamen at the same height strap it all around now just press open the yellow strips so the of white color would show only the yellow strip not the red one like this now take the petal first just at random you know just press the paper in the center upwards and downwards like this then give crimps on the edge all around the petal like so then give a fold about you know like this about more than half the petal on one side give a sharp sharp crease really sharp crease then again fold it just about 1 mm 1 mm wide and give a crease again and then again fold it so you have three creases sharp ones so this is what it looks like it's not necessary that they should be parallel or anything just the creases should be there now take the pink pencil and on the creases just color them in straight lines straight strokes try to make it as dark as possible so that it shows properly like so and then just curve the tail so this is how the petals would look i made the others in the same way Now take the petal, apply glue on the base, and stick this on the center that we've made. So just stick it below the stamen. and stick all the other petals in the same way slightly overlapping each other on the center so just overlap it a bit and stick it so it will be slightly below the first one in the same way stick all the other four petals So this is how the flower would look. Now cut a bit of a PP uh, floral tape. Sorry. Stretch it and wind this on the base of the flower. Like 
this flower does not have any sepals so uh, you just cover the base that we made like this now cut another piece from the thin wire 6 cm long now take the green tape again and cover it like this take the leaf first go lines on it in the center and then on the side like this then as we did for the petal just push and pull the paper in the center and give crimps on the side of the leaf like this and then just curl the tip just a little bit now turn it over apply glue in the center and stick this wire that we made while rotating the stem of the leaf so you get a leaf like this so I have made others same way like this now take the green floral tape pull out a long piece stretch it now I've made two flowers you can make more first just hold the flower stem next to the thick wire and start winding the tape on it just a little and then attach some small leaves a pair of leaves actually opposite to each other so they should be opposite to each other and then just wrap the tape over then leave about an inch and then attach some big leaves same way since this plant is basically a vine, a climber, so you can attach as many leaves and as many flowers that you want. Then attach this other flower. Again, I'm going to attach a small leaf opposite to each other. then the bigger leaves till the end of the wire Now just open out the leaves
and this is how the flower would look now clematis comes in variety of colors i have made another one in hot pink purplish pink like this all the measurements are in centimeter this is a strip for a center this is 2.5 by 8 cm cut one piece this is a strip for stamen this is again 2.5 by 8 cm cut one piece this is for the petal this is 8 cm by 4 cm stem being 1 by 1 cut six or seven pieces these are of the leaves smaller one is 7 cm by 3.5 cm the stem is 1.1 cm by 1 cm and the bigger leaf i made is 9.5 cm and the width is 4.5 cm stem being again 1 by 1 so cut as many as you like